Hey guys, it's Troy from Troy's Movies here, and today we're digging into the deep earth. What do you think we'll find? Treasure? Riches? That one sock I lost two years ago? Who knows? Oh, I think I see something. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Ah! Records. No way. No way, I know it, it's true! Could there be more? Hey guys, it's Trip from Troy's Movies, and I have returned to the surface and have scanned all of the documents into Adobe Acrobat. And here we have our entire timeline of ancient history. So if you know the Fixing the World's Borders series that I did a ways back, it's going to be similar to that. We're just basically going to be changing some of this boring text here and changing it into nice borders on the map. Cycladic culture in Greece. Now that's kind of cool. Cycladic. In fact, I think I'm going to change it to Cyclops culture in Greece. And then I'm going to add onto it a bread. The Cyclops Bruce elective reading and it is now a reality some kind of greek thing goes on it's kind of like the first egyptian <coughs> civilization i guess or the, at least the first like major one all right there we go we have our egypt Stonehenge construction begins. Alright, so if you know anything about Stonehenge, it's pretty boring, but I don't think we need it. And so I think we can get rid of Stonehenge construction begins. In its first version, it consisted of a circular ditch and bank with 56 wooden posts. Oh wow, so it was even more useless. Running. Culture begins in Iran. Get it? Because uh, I ran. Uh, <laughs> Don't exactly know what the borders of this are. We'll just go with like something like this. Honestly, that's really cool. Um, but I am gonna put they also buried treasure there. You know, just to kind of kickstart colonialism a little bit. Domestication of the horse. I mean, do we really need that? Horses are pretty annoying if you ask me. You can ride them, but they take a lot of work. Eh, let's just get rid of that. Longshan culture begins in China. Um, what kind of culture is that? Longhand. You know what? I'll go with that. Minoan civilization reaches 80,000 inhabitants. Nah. How about... 80 million inhabitants. It's gonna be the star of the ancient world, bro. Oh, and the Old Kingdom begins in Egypt. Mature Harappan phase. Do we really need to mature Pakistan and India? I don't... I don't think we do. Emergence of Maya culture in the Yucatan Peninsula. How about the Yucatan Peninsula and 
most of Central America. We can start making that epic Mayan Empire about now. We have the great Mayan Empire. King Khufu completes the Great Pyramid of Giza. Alright, here it is. It's finally time. No way, I know it! It's true! I think you all saw this one coming. There it is. The Land of Punt in the Horn of Africa. Well, if it's called the Land of Punt, it first appears in Egyptian records around this time. Which leads to the invention of American football. I mean, it's the land of punt. Like, I, I kind of have to. <laughs> I love seeing it go through. It's going to be so fun to see um, actually put together at the end. The last mammoth population on Wrangell Island in Siberia goes extinct. Nah. Nah. That is sad. Why don't we have mammoths today? So instead of that, I'm going to say the mammoth population on Wrangell Island in Siberia moves on to the mainland. It's literally going to be Ice Age, bro. Acadian Empire is founded. Dating depends upon whether the middle chronology or the short chronology is used. Nah, I'm going to say short chronology because I know all you watching this on YouTube shorts. Akkadian Empire, based upon the YouTube shorts chronology. 4.2 kilo year event, a severe aridification phase likely connected to a Bond event. Yo, 007, James Bond, this was an inside job. Um, I'm just going to put James Bond event. We have reached classical antiquity now. It's a broad term for a long period of cultural history in ancient Greece and ancient Rome. So we have the first recorded ancient Olympic Games over here, but we can add a little bit more to it. And I think what I want to add to that is break dancing was not an event. There we go, just wanted to shame the 2024 Olympics a little bit. Spring and autumn period begins in China. Doesn't that happen every year, China? She didn't have to cut me off. Like that. Like that. Like that. We Rise of the Median Empire. Huh. Somebody didn't do math. We need the rise of the Mean, Median, and Mode Empire. And it is going to be fully focused on math and science. Oh, also, Rome is founded by the Carthaginians now. The Roman Carthaginians. You know what I do. Draco. I think you know what I have to do. Draco Malfoy replaces oral law with written law in Hogwarts. Cyrus the Great overthrows Croesus, King of Lydia. In fact, why don't we just call him Cyrus the Terrible now? The fall of the Neo-Babylonian Empire and liberation of the Jews by Cyrus the Great. How about the creation of the Neo-Babylonian Empire and subjugation of the Jews by Cyrus the Terrible. Oh wait, I have a funnier idea. 404 BC. Alright, time skip. Finally got into the Roman conquest of Greece, so the Roman Empire is expanding quite a bit. I'm going to keep that going on. Roman armies enter Gaul for the first time and capture it fully. Nice. First Chinese domination of Vietnam in form of the Nauinye Kingdom. Now, nah, I'm going to get rid of that. I like our Kanye Kingdom. Now, Rome is massive already. They're, they're like huge. The siege of Jerusalem leads to the conquest of Judea by the Romans. 
but also they expand more south, reaching the tip of Arabia. You know, gotta make the Roman Empire bigger for the Rome stands. We're getting close to the birth of Christ now. All this coastal stuff. Maybe even Djibouti as well. I mean, why not? You're already here. This Burabista conquers territory from South Germany to Thrace, reaching the coast of the Aegean Sea. But how about we also have Rome makes them a tributary state. Yeah, we gotta have that massive Roman Empire, dude. Look at that huge, huge. 31 to 30 BC, Battle of Actium, the Roman conquest of Ptolemaic Egypt. So Rome gets all this. Kingdom's period begins in Korea, so there is a Korea. Rome makes a couple of autonomous areas. You know, I personally think that would look better on the map. Crucifixion of Jesus Christ between 26 and 34. Oh, and right after that, death of Emperor Tiberius. Dude, Emperor Caligula is assassinated. That's a sad, this is a sad time in history. The Roman Empire enters Great Britain for the first time at 43 AD. Um, we do have a kingdom there, though. The, um, Hogwarts Kingdom. You see, Hogwarts versus the Roman Empire. It's a fight, you know. But 79 AD, destruction of Pompeii. We need this, because the song Pompeii wouldn't have been made without it. And that's a great song, so we're gonna keep it in. But if you close your eyes... It's tragic, but we gotta. Roman Empire, at largest extent under Trajan, having conquered modern-day Romania, Iraq, and Armenia. Perfect. The Buddhist Sri Java Empire established in maritime Southeast Asia. Uh, nah, we don't need this, see. <laughs> Romans in Africa by this point convert to Carthaginian ways. Most frequently cited date for the end of ancient history. Cyclops culture in Greece. They bred the Cyclops through selective breeding, and it is now a reality. Peru exists, but is swiftly forgotten. Scara Blay is built in Scotland's Orkney Islands. The first and largest of these islands is called Big Island, so as not to confuse it with the Scottish mainland. First Dynasty of Egypt. Cuctini Tripilia culture is established in Romania and Ukraine. It is so successful that it even expands a bit into Russia. Running culture begins in Iran. First known use of papyrus by Egyptians. The pastoral Neolithic culture builds East Africa's earliest and largest monumental cemetery at Lothagam North Pillar site. They also buried treasure there. Caught digi phase of the Indus Valley civilization begins. Longhand culture begins in China. Minoan civilization, ancient palace city Knossos, reaches 80 million inhabitants. The Old Kingdom begins in Egypt. Oldest known surviving literature, running joke from Abu Salakib, including the instructions of Shurapak, your bags and leave. Mature Harappan phase of the Indus Valley civilization begins. Emergence of Mayan culture in the Yucatan Peninsula and most of Central America. The aliens complete the Great Pyramid of Giza. The land of Punt in the Horn of Africa first appears in Egyptian records around this time, which leads to the invention of American football. Karma culture begins in Nubi. Literally everyone got owned XD. The mammoth population on Wrangell Island in Siberia moves onto the mainland and forms a great mammoth resurgence. Akkadian Empire is founded based on the YouTube short chronology. Pharaoh Teti is thought to be the earliest known victim of assassination. Oldest known depiction of the Staff God, whose real name is Jeffrey Bezos, found in the Americas. 4.2 Kelly-Year event, a severe eridification phase, likely connected to a James Bond event, which was registered throughout most of North Africa, 
Middle East, and continental North America. Minoan eruption destroys Akrarti and causes damage to some Minoan sites in eastern Crete. The beginning of Shank Dynasty in China, evidence of a fully developed writing system. This period is also the setting of the Iliad and the Odyssey epic poems, which were composed about four centuries later. The Hallstatt culture begins. The Zoo Keepers, led by King Harambe, overthrows the last king of Shank Dynasty, Zoo Dynasty, established in China. Approximate date for the composition of the Iliad and the Odyssey. Foundation of Carthage Province by the Romans in Tunisia. Rise of the Kingdom of Kush. First recorded ancient Olympic Games. Breakdancing, while considered, was not an event. Founding of Rome by the Roman Carthaginians. Rise of the Mean, Median, and Mode Empire. Draco Malfoy replaces oral law with written law in Hogwarts, considered one of the earliest developments of magic. Panjing Kingdom is founded in South India. Evidence of writing system appears in Oksaka, used by the Discotech civilization. Rise of the Sao civilization near, fittingly, Sao Paulo. The Mean, Median, and Mode Empire is overthrown by Cyrus the Terrible. The creation of the Neo-Babylonian Empire and subjugation of the Jews by Cyrus the Terrible. Death of Cyrus the Terrible. Cambyses II of Persia conquers ancient Egypt. Darius I, Darius the Great of Persia, subjugates Eastern Thrace. Macedonia submits voluntarily. Persian Empire at largest extent. Panini standardizes the grammar and morphology of Sanskrit in the text Ashtadhyayi. Indian boycott of Greek food by Panini begins the Battle of Salami. Minor Roman expansion. Warring states period begins in China as the zoo keepers become mere figureheads. China is annexed by regional warlords. The Greco-Persian Wars end with a peace treaty ceding minor parts of Asia Minor to Greece. Not found! Alexander the Great defeats Darius III of Persia in the Battle of Guagnella, completing his conquest of Persia. Alexander the Great defeats Indian King Porus in the Battle of the Hydapses River. Minor expansion of Rome into southern Italy. Death of Alexander the Great at Babylon. Establishment of the Seleucid Empire by Seleucus I Nicotic. Chola Empire forms in South India. Construction of the Great Pyramid of Cholula, the world's largest pyramid by volume begins in Cholula, Puebla, Mexico. This one, like Giza, was also built by aliens. A sh emergence of Savannah in South India. Qin Shi Huang unifies China, marking the beginning of the Qin Dynasty. Battle of Kane, Rome expands up into Italy a bit. Kingdom of Kanye extends from Guangzhou to North Vietnam. Chera Dynasty in South India. Shunga Empire founded. Maccabean Revolt. Third puny Roman expansion between Rome and everyone else. War ends with Rome conquering all of modern-day Tunisia and Libya, and a bit more. Roman conquest of Greece. See Roman Greece. Eurytides I dies from disease. Greek bacteria kingdom collapses. Remnants die off from disease. Roman armies enter Gaul for the first time and capture it fully. Rome conquers all of Italy, connecting their realms. Berberista becomes the king of Dacia which also BTW is an independent nation. Ow. The siege of Jerusalem leads to the conquest of Judea by the Romans. They expand more south, reaching the tip of Arabia, as well as eastern Turkey, to connect their lands. Borobista conquers territories from south Germany to Thrace, reaching the coast of the Aegean Sea. Rome makes them a tributary state. Roman civil war between Julius Caesar and Pompey the Great. It ended in an explosive finale. Julius Caesar murdered by Marcus Brutus and others. Berebista is assassinated in the same year, like Julius Caesar, and every single Romanian goes missing. Battle of Actium, the Roman conquest of Ptolemaic Egypt, and a little more in the Horn of Africa. Rome expands into Spain to make the map finally complete. Rome makes a couple of autonomous areas, such as Arabia, East Africa, and Judea. A small Russian kingdom is made. Battle of the Teteberg Forest. The Imperial Roman Army's bloodiest defeat. However, they don't lose any land because they are that gigachet. Octavian, ascension of his adopted son Tiberius to the throne. Rome also expands into more of the Middle East. Rome conquers Mauritania. The Roman Empire enters Great Britain for the first time. They are mildly successful, but the city of London remains controlled by wizards like Harry Potter who have not yet given up the fight. Kingdom of Aksum forms in the Horn of Africa, rebelling from Rome. 
Roman Empire at largest extent under Trajan after having conquered modern day Romania, Iraq, and Armenia. They also fully subjugate the wizards, incorporating magic into the Roman Guard. Kingdom of Champa in Tai Nguyen. Three Kingdoms period begins in China after the fall of Qin Dynasty. Fall of the Parthian Empire and rise of the Sassi Empire. Dialog Tian becomes Emperor of Rome and splits the Roman Empire into Eastern and Western Roman Empire. Armenia first to adopt Christianity as state religion. Emperor Constantine I dies, leaving his sons not ruling the first, not ruling the second, and Emperor Constantine II as the emperors of the Roman Empire. Emperor Constantine II is left sole emperor with the death of his two brothers. Fitting, since they couldn't rule. Birth of Augustine the Hippo. Emperor Constantine II dies. His cousin King Julian succeeds him. He then claims Madagascar for the Byzantines, as it is his homeland. Battle of Adrianople. Roman army is defeated by the Germanic tribe. Romans are expelled from Britain. Hogwarts retains direct rule over the island of Great Britain. Visigoths and other Germanic tribes cross into Roman Gaul for the first time. Visigoths sack Rome in 410 for the first time since 390 BC. They lose Italy and surrounding islands. Germanic tribes enter Spain. Romans in Africa by this time convert into Carthaginian ways, most frequently cited date for the end of ancient history.